John, I just recalled that we were living here on Cordona in a manor. And there was a policeman. Really? What else do you remember? What happened to our mother? The memory was vague, a, a mere flash. I have to find our house. Absolutely. Let's do it. Are you able to help me? I wish I could help you, but I don't know. I'm done with the archives for now. Can I help you with anything else? As a matter of fact, you can. The thing is, our chief inspector has vanished, as if we weren't undermanned enough as it is. Wait, what do you mean, vanished? Gone missing on a case. Shady business, but that's besides the point. See that board? Pending cases are posted there for any available officers to investigate. I would take them myself, except that I've been told to work the reception desk, like some clerk. Yes, we're that short-handed. I understand your predicament, but what does any of it have to do with me? I may be available, but I'm certainly not an officer. Oh, don't worry about it. Consider yourself a temporary one-man independent police force. That's a bit of a mouthful. There's just one small, minor, basic formality. You'll need to complete our physical training course. Easy. Well, I'm not one to balk at a spot of exercise. What must I do? Ask the spirit. Sergeant Ermy will show you the ropes. Follow me. So, you're a newcomer. We must be desperate to ask untrained civilians for help. You're lucky to have a well-trained civilian with a brand new auto pistol in his arsenal. An automatic? A bit of a braggart, aren't you? Are you trying to test me already? That is why you're here, boy. I need to verify your skills before I can allow you to catch criminals. The first targets are in the next room. You know what to do with them. I'll join you in a while to see the results. Concentrate, Sherry. You need to hit every target to show the sergeant how we do it. Proceed to the next room. Meanwhile, I'll fill out the paperwork. Come on, Sherry. It's just like in childhood. <laughs> Steady, Sherry. Steady, and my favorite mannequins for attack. Let's Uh oh, Sherry, not a nice shot. You could have killed the fella. Uh oh, Sherry, not a nice shot. 
You could have killed the fella if he was alive. I could do this all day. Please don't, Sherry. We don't have that much time. Let's move on. Our enemies might be stronger than us, but we rely on... Uh-oh, oh, Sherry. Not a nice armor. shot. You could have killed the fella. Uh-oh, Sherry. Not a nice shot. You could have killed the fella if he was alive. The snuff's ready. Hooray! All right, let's move on, Sherry. If you stand here and use your snuff box on them, you can definitely overcome them, Sherry. I'm trying to estimate the range for your snuff box. Look at that helmet of his. You won't be able to get the powder past it. Helpful advice, John. I would never have guessed. Good job, new boy. Well, I'm almost finished with the paperwork. Let's talk about your results. Well, I must say your results aren't as bad as I feared. Perhaps you're not completely hopeless, but true combat is quite different from shooting stationary targets. I'll handle it just as easily. Well, that's what we're going to find out. Now, we'll test you against our men. Your task is to detain them, not to kill them. So don't go shooting anyone in the eye. That goes for in the field as well. Even though you'll be working with the police department, that doesn't mean you have a license to kill. Here, take these. They are blank rounds. So, are you ready? Always ready. Then let's get cracking. Worried? Not at all. I can hit them all with one shot. Good luck, Sherry. And remember, the surroundings are your playground. 